Lord. Well, Cornerstone wants to give you, uh, actually we're giving it to the Lord, but we're giving it to you just as a gift of appreciation. Uh, let me be number one. Okay. <laughs> I, I'll give, You're number I, I, one. I'll give, because I want to tell you why. I met Steve some time ago, and I have one of his CDs. I play it all the time. It's a blessing. I haven't heard this, but I can guarantee a blessing. Well, I, I, th I think... I think you ought to tell how we met Steve years ago down at the NRB. You and, and dear brother Russ yes, met him. Yes, we did. He came up to our booth. I don't know if he remembers, but I remember. I don't know how many years ago it was, but it was a while. And, and he introduced himself, and he said he liked to come and sing. And we said, okay, we'll see what we can do about it. And he came, and, and he hadn't been here for quite a while. And I, I, I just loved his music so much. And, so I said something to Teresa, who is not, no longer with us, and I said, you really need to invite him. And she says, is he really that good? good. <laughs> and I said, oh yes. He's like, I hesitate to say this, <laughs> but this is what I said. He's like a Christian Frank Sinatra. I mean, he <laughs> sings the word of God. He sings the word of God, you that's know, right. You know, he's mellow and just a blessing in my house when I you play know, people, it. He compared himself, he said he loved hearing Jim Neighbors when he was a kid. And people think of Jim Neighbors as Gomer Pyle. They don't realize that Jim, some of them don't realize Jim Neighbors has an absolutely gorgeous voice. And uh, I think actually he sings better than Frank Sinatra. Uh, well, he does, he does. We but have, I didn't know how to explain yeah. well, it to cut, Teresa. Yeah, just a deep, rich voice. I want, you brought this wonderful, wonderful CD. Tell me about that. Well, this has really been uh, a great joy in recording, primarily because I've worked with Larry Goss there in Nashville, who did all the arrangements and stuff. But it's sort of a, a, a walk through my life musically. Um, when you get the CD, you'll see the little notes and stuff that share the, the different segments. Like I, I've got a song... Uh, uh, my tribute there. I sang at my high school graduation mm -hmm. and the first solo I ever sang. Um, but we found wonderful songs that really spoke to my heart. It, it's, you know, after doing this for 27 years and, and this is my seventh CD, um, all the, the typical processes that I used to go through and picking out songs and stuff has just gone totally out the door. Because now it's, it's all about what I've got something I want to say Amen. And let's find the songs that can resonate with my life experience. And if it resonates with my experience, then it will resonate with others that are walking the same path. So. Amen. Well, people are calling already, and uh, several have called. Rose uh, from St. Mary's wants your...